Nice 15 to 5 hobo opener win for the men's lacrosse team. 10th year head coach in Pete Lawrence, and uh, without a couple key starters, and you got down one nothing, but quickly, just kind of like an old car. Once you got going, kind of a little bit of cruise control into that 15 to 5 win. You have to be happy with everybody that stepped up, being down a couple key guys. Sure, I thought uh, you know what the big difference was early in the game was uh, the man down group. We obviously took a number of penalties, and if they're able to kind of you know go up three four, you know it, it, the game I think feels a little different. And obviously, um, I thought the defense played great. You know, a few little cracks there at the very end. Um, but I think, uh, you know, overall, the, the defense, great performance. Ryan Vanderford, you know, was great in the goal, made a lot of huge saves. Um, and it just took us a little bit longer than I would have liked for our offense to kind of get going. But when they did, like, you know, uh, 15 goals is, uh, is a great effort. We got to play a lot of guys today. So, uh, like you said, a good, uh, a good start for, uh, at the Zook, like we had talked uh, prior, you know. I know just the second game of the season right now, but I figure on a scout early on, they're going to focus on uh, Schultz, Yee, and O'Shea, but you had five freshmen that recorded their first collegiate goals, and uh, are you a little bit happy knowing the fact that you can get offense from other places? Absolutely. I mean, I think that's... Um you know, one of the things that when you have uh, some injuries and you have some other guys playing, it's an opportunity. And I think in the long run, it's, it's going to lead to, you know, more depth. Um, but I think uh, those guys you named, I think, uh, you know, stepped up and, and they did some good things. And I think, again, it just took it just took the younger guys a little bit longer to get going. But I think in the end, it's nice. You know, I didn't know five guys had their first goals. I knew there was definitely a number of them. You know, at one point I'm looking out there and going, man, like other than just, you know, one or two guys is all freshmen on the field right now. So, uh, no, happy for those guys. It'll be a quick turnaround for you guys as the Bears of Brown will come into town on Wednesday. You guys with this big win, even your overall record at 1-1, one and one, you're now 1-0 and oh here at home. So what is a win like? this do for you getting prepared uh, to head into your second home game yeah I mean you know this is the first time we've had like the quick turnaround and they'll have the same thing they were playing UMass today and uh, now we got to see how quickly we can learn from uh, you know some of the positives and some of the mistakes uh, and, and tighten things up because uh, you know Brown uh, is a tougher opponent than I think uh, Manhattan you know they're they got a strong team so um, it, it's been a good series the last they took the last two we took the two prior to that um, you know so I expect a good game on uh, on Wednesday Despite the fact that it was freezing cold out here, good crowd uh, on hand for the home opener for the men's lacrosse team, and they take care of business with a 15-5 to win atop of Manhattan. They'll be back in action uh, coming up on Wednesday against Brown at 3.30. Stay tuned to HartfordHawks.com for all the latest.